Now, what are some of the implications of these sanctions on a sitting president and his vice president? Yes, uh, the implications of these sanctions are uh, pretty much narrowed down uh, the regime of sanctions that uh, um, you know members of uh, the Zimbabwean government had. Uh, I would say that uh, you know uh, President Mnangagwa and Vice President Chiwenga were pretty much on the previous regime of sanctions. So this is a continuation uh, of them being on uh, on sanctions, and also uh, probably narrowing it down to the head of the government uh, and also his inner circle. Now, the U.S. has also announced visa and economic sanctions on members of the Zimbabwe government for political and human rights abuses. But the question is, how will these measures punish these individuals? Yes, I think uh, probably these measures might uh, uh, now be strictly, uh, you know, uh, going towards uh, those specific uh, individuals who are mentioned in those sanctions. Uh, just a comparison with the previous uh, regime of sanctions, which are... Uh, pretty much at a blanket, uh, you know, uh, sanction of uh, members of uh, the ruling party ZANU-PF and other entities that were associated with ZANU-PF. These ones pretty much are very clear as to who they are targeting uh, and also uh, the organizations or uh, uh, companies that have been involved in, uh, in corruption, uh, which has been documented by, uh, you know, several media houses and also uh, human rights institutions. Can, in what ways will these uh, sanctions impact uh, Zimbabwe as a country and the U.S.-Zimbabwe relations? Yes, uh, I mean, like, uh, I always, uh, you know, compare with the previous regime uh, of sanctions uh, because these ones are, are pretty much now narrowing down to the individuals. Uh, and also uh, the impact might be that uh, those targeted individuals uh, might be, you know, put out there in the open for them to address the issues that are being raised by why these sanctions are available. Uh, President Nangagwa being singled out and his vice president as well, uh, his family and uh, other members actually puts uh, probably an introspective on some Zimbabweans to, to say that probably these sanctions are pretty much targeted to those individuals and not uh, to the country as a whole.